this article is a partial outcome of the PC studies that CERN Bering performed at the Copenhagen Business School and that I had the pleasure to supervise. It presents a comparative case study of forward integration from manufacturing towards downstream distribution, sales, and services offerings, executed closer to the final end users of the manufacturing products in the markets. Forward integration among manufacturing com uh, companies is a very commonly observed phenomenon that reflects what some refer to as integration-oriented servitization. Yet the governance aspects of successful integration strategies have rarely been examined. And that's exactly what we do by comparing a consistently outperforming integrated manufacturing firm with, firm, with a firm that performs in line with the uh, general industry. And we find that the outperforming firm puts equal emphasis on production and services capabilities. It prioritizes the generation of customer value flexibility in modular production, and not least collaborative efforts across linked activities uh, throughout the value chain, driven by very strong corporate values. The power performer, by comparison, prioritizes operating efficiency, product engineering, all managed through central control, through planning, standardization, and tight management reporting. So we conclude that effective integration-oriented servitization in manufacturing relies on a specific organizational structure with coordination approaches geared to deal with changing customer demands in complex dynamic product markets that we see in contemporary environments. Now, these approaches are deeply ingrained in corporate values embedded in an organizational culture that has been developed over time and that is very difficult to emulate by close competitors. We believe that these insights have the potential to uh, illustrate important benchmarks for manufacturing executives that grapple with the implementation of uh, successful servitization strategies. Furthermore, as manufacturing remains the backbone of our modern economies, we also think it has potential significance for uh, our ability to enhance value creation in our societies.